Andrew Rube Foster was born in Calvert, Texas in 1879 on September 17th. He was the youngest of five children and developed a passion for baseball at a very young age. After the eighth grade, he dropped out of school to pursue his love for the sport. The first team he played for was a local team called the Waco Yellow Jackets. In 1902, Rube Foster moved north to play for the Chicago Union Giants, which was one of the top African-American teams in the country at the time. With the Giants, Foster managed to win 44 consecutive games. The following year, Foster played for the Cuban ex-Giants for one season, and then in 1904 went on to join his former opponents, the Philadelphia Giants. Rube Foster joined the Leland Giants in 1907 as not only a team member, but also the manager of the team. This quickly proved that he was as adept at organizing and strategizing as he was at pitching and hitting. Foster then decided to part ways with the company's owner and form his own team, which eventually became known as the Chicago American Giants. Under his leadership, they went on to become one of the leading African-American teams in baseball history. Foster experienced a mental breakdown in 1926 and spent his final years in an asylum in Kankakee, Illinois. He died at the asylum on December 9, 1930 at the age of 51. 51 years after his passing, Foster was finally admitted into the Baseball Hall of Fame in 1981. He is now remembered as the father of the Negro Leagues.